youtube channel please if you have not subscribed please subscribe as you do so may god bless you in jesus name inshallah amen and for those of you that are subscribed i pray may god grant your heart desire this year in the mighty name of jesus amen my lovely fans the battle have just begun my lovely fans juju who have come to finish you le doshe chai what a life juju who have come to destroy you le doshe what a life that you let Doshe is living, my lovely fans. What a life. This time around, my people, we all saw how Pete Doshe has been trying his possible best to fight for his son. They told Pete Doshe that there is a cloud surrounding the family of the Doshe, that this cloud needs to be removed before another tears before this family. Right now, why Pete Doshe is busy fighting this one, another one don't come outside again, no. Una see and say pet edoshe, hey hey. We don't know if this one is called Kamau or Yule Doshe have just decided to bring pains upon his father. According to the information right now, why pet edoshe is fighting one, another one don't come again. According to the information, they say they've called pet edoshe to tell pet edoshe that he should pray against shame. Shame is coming to his family. Shame is coming to that family. They have bring shame. They have bring shame in the spiritual realms that is going to manifest in the physical realms. <laughs> hey, my people. According to what we're hearing right now, they say Juju Eko is his spiritual husband. He don't provoke again. Ever since then, Juju Eko is has been feeding the spiritual husband with what he wants. This time around, Juju Eko is does he turn her back against her spiritual husband. We all know that Juju Eko is have a special family that she loves so much in the spiritual realms. Those families are so special to Juju Kwesu that she don't even care about her physical children. She don't care about their situation. She don't care about how the children are even growing up. In not care because she already have a lovely family in her spiritual realms. So, this is her spiritual husband, which we all know that when a woman has a spiritual husband, there are certain things that need to be done. If you want to be truly be free from them, it's either you go through Christianity, or you go through the Muslim way, or you go through the uh, uh, traditional or uh, spiritual way. So, any way you want to go through it, it's okay for you. Anyone where your mind is carried, I don't go against any religion, because the other side of the world, nobody has seen it. So, my people... According to what we all know, these are certain things that need to be done when somebody have the spiritual husband. You need to cut the wife off from there. You need to free the person you are about to marry to. If it's a woman, if it's a man, not only women, eh? also some men, they have spiritual wife. They have spiritual wife. Their wife, they suffer. They suffer away well, well, for the marriage. And they think that it's only women. No, some men, they have spiritual wife also. So this spiritual husband of you, like Doshe, you have a... Uh, Juju Ekwesu, sorry guys. Juju Ekwesu has been giving him what he wants is there. It was okay for him for some time. But this time around, the man don't provoke again because according to what we're hearing right now, the spiritual husband of Yule Doshe, of, uh, sorry guys, the spiritual husband of Juju Ekwesu, there are certain agreement between Judy Austin and her spiritual husband, which Judy Austin is not keeping to right now. So for this reason, Juju Ekwesu, hmm, the spiritual husband has started attacking you like Doshe because what they do they don't attack their own wife or their own husband they attack the person that is distracting their wife or their husband or their boyfriend or their girlfriend from them so right now they say this spiritual husband has started attacking you like Doshe again because the spiritual husband wants Juju Kwesu to do some certain things to you like Doshe because according to what we hear, they say this spiritual husband of Juju Ekwensu, what they do, they are using Yule Doshe. Yule Doshe is just like an object that they are using. The spiritual husband is present in Juju Ekwensu's life for 247. And the reason the spiritual husband is angry now is that Juju Ekwensu is pregnant. I did a video when I told you guys that she's expecting. Yes, she's expecting. So the spiritual husband wants to terminate that pregnancy. And the only way the spiritual husband can terminate the pregnancy is by sleeping with Juju Kwesu. Which Juju Kwesu has turned her back against her spiritual husband. Maybe she wants to have this one. We don't know. She won't burn this one. Because when she wants to give birth, she has to do some kind of rituals. Begging her spiritual husband. She, she knows what to do. She knows how to go about it to do with her spiritual husband so that she can have a physical child. If not, that physical child, they are going to destroy it through miscarriage. 
So right now, it's like Juju Kwezu want to have another one again. But I said this one now, she wants to burn this one. So it has become another battle. And according to what we heard, apart from that, the spiritual husband said, Juju Le Doshe, be like person when they come back to his senses. Because he has no access to Yule Doshe like an object anymore. There are certain things he want to use Yule Doshe for, he cannot use him. The man they use the spiritual husband of Juju Ekwensu is using Yule Doshe just like an object. So right now he has no access to Yule Doshe like that because the father of Yule Doshe is doing serious spiritual work on Yule Doshe. So when they start fighting your spiritual battle, a lot of people that are oppressing you, their hands go stop dance more. Because you are retaliating back. So that is the problem right now. The spiritual husband is angry. Jujue Kwesu is not supposed to allow such things to happen. Jujue Kwesu is supposed to give a spiritual husband full access to control Yule Doshi. Jujue Kwesu is supposed to allow a spiritual husband to use Yule Doshi the way he wants. So right now, that access is not there. Because Peter Doshe is doing some kind of spiritual work on his son. So Yule Doshe look like something untouchable. And number two, Jijue Kwesu pregnancy. Spiritual husband don't provoke. Now, according to the information, the spiritual husband wants to make Yule Doshe run mad. Because they have been trying to buy Yule Doshe. <laughs> A lot of you don't know. They don't try to remove him. They find out that removing him will cause problems, will cause calamity. That's why they hold their hand. Because if anything happened to Yule Doshi, the whole world will hold Juju Ekwensu. So she knows what it means. That's why she raised, put her hand down. She is ready. She's the force that is ready to devour this man. Juju Ekwensu did not come to Yule Doshi life to help him. She came to bring this man down. Just as this man is going down every day. She has come to destroy this man. Yes, that is what she came for. So right now, they see that they cannot buy him. According to the information, they say they want to throw madness on him. We all know he has his own problem already. By the time this madness comes, they will call it bipolar. They will call it different scientific name. But that is not the problem with Yule Doshi. That is spiritual problem. So they say Juju Kwesu's spiritual husband is ready to throw madness to Yule Doshi right now. It's either Juju Kwesu do the needful. And you let Doshi is either he return back to where he did the slave with the tire, put for chain for a neck like dog, they use her as an object, or rather, Juju Ekwen go and remove that pregnancy anyway. They're very easy for them to remove it when you have a spiritual husband or a spiritual wife. When the man, uh, when the man wife is pregnant, <laughs> my people, when uh, just as Juju Ekwen is pregnant right now, it's only for a spiritual husband to sleep with her and she will miscarry. That pregnancy is gone. So Juju Kwensu knows very well the, the consequence of sleeping with her spiritual husband. She has been turning him down. And this is not going well with the spiritual husband. The spiritual husband has put that anger on Yule Doshi. And Juju Kwensu have to do the needful immediately because those people, they don't have mercy. They don't have pity when they want to strike. And Juju Kwensu knows very well that when the spiritual husband strike Yule Doshi, it will be on her. Now she people will drag because now she deal with Yule Doshi. When she collect Yule Doshi, Yule Doshi was okay. Yule Doshi was living his life. He still did Nollywood. They do everything. The moment Juju Kwesu entered, why is it that everything changed about Yule Doshi? This is to tell you that even the spiritual husband of Juju Kwesu is not happy with Yule Doshi. They say they are torturing him right now in the spiritual realms. They are torturing him. They send all kind of attack. To you, Edoshe. The only thing that is protecting you, Edoshe, now is what the Father is doing. The the church through salvation ministry where Juju where you, Edoshe, open, they've turned it to their spiritual uh, uh, kingdom where they go there to operate. Everything about you, Edoshe, is in their hands. They control the smile like remote control. They use him. Anything you see you, Edoshe, doing is not with his clear eye. According to what we hear, they say the spiritual husband sometimes even come as in form of Yule Doshi, enter into Yule Doshi and be using him to do karikasha of himself. They say the spiritual husband of Juju Kwensu is really operating on Yule Doshi and Juju Kwensu knows very well. Yet, she is still there. The only solution is for Juju Kwensu to walk out of the life of Yule Doshi.
Because Juju Kwensu, if she really wants to stay with you, like she, why don't she break up from her spiritual husband? That is what every woman that really wants to settle down their life. The moment you find out that you have a spiritual husband, the first step you take is to cancel, is to um, divorce yourself from that spiritual husband, is to cut off that spiritual husband by any means, like I said before. If you are a Christian, if you are a Muslim, if you are a traditionalist, if you are a spiritualist, any way you want to go about it. But the first step is to divorce yourself. You need to cut that spiritual husband or wife off because if you don't cut them off they will still be part of your marriage part of your life part of your finance part of everything you do the time will even come they will start controlling just like that of Juju Kwensu they say the spiritual husband they control they control the household of Juju Kwensu sometimes he's the one that decide what they will do and what they will not do so this whole thing is affecting you Edoshi the whole a spiritual husband of a teen that Juju Kwensu has brought with her to marry Yule Doshi is affecting Yule Doshi. The reason why many things is not working for Yule Doshi, the reason why things are falling apart for Yule Doshi is this same spiritual husband. They have, they are very jealous, very, very jealous of their spouse. They don't want them to be with anybody. They don't want anybody to touch them. You are there sleeping with a woman that has a spiritual husband. The husband is there. By the time you do finish, if care is not taken, they will take what you pour inside that woman. They will take it and use it against you. That is how they do it. So we should be very careful because this of Juju Kwensu, she knows very well that the only way, if she really wants to stay with you, like Doshe, if she really loves you, like Doshe, why didn't she remove her spiritual husband? Her spiritual husband is still there to tell you that she only came to destroy this man. Because any woman that is holding on to her spiritual husband and she wants to have a physical husband, that woman wants to destroy the life of the physical husband. Because the physical husband is not seeing what is happening in the spiritual realms. He don't know what is happening. It takes only you that knows that you have a spiritual husband to do the needful. So right now, my people, according to the information, no, they don't let us know. Say, Yule Doshe is in danger right now. Because the spiritual husband of Jujoku is the verse. And is ready to strike and what did they call and say, now madness. Kolo Meta, that is what he wants to strike you like Doshi with. And Juju Ekwensu need to do the needful immediately. And she know what to do. That is what they say. She knows what to do. She is strong for inside this matter. A woman that is marrying physical and spiritual husband together is a wicked woman. Is a destroyer. Because the spiritual husband not the rest, the physical husband not the rest. And who pays more is the physical husband. Just as you like Doshe is now. They say not be small torture that they torture around. Thank God that the father is doing some kind of things for you like Doshe. If not by this time. <laughs> you like Doshe for that year around, not be small. Because the spiritual husband say enough is enough. You want to remove you like Doshe from the road. But they cannot because just like I explained before. So right now they say the man don't carry the cup of madness in the spiritual realms. This man is already holding the cup. It's for him to pour it. So he's giving Jujue Kwensu time to do the needful. If not, if they come, if they come pour out on Yule Doshi. And that will be the end of Yule Doshi. So that thing will take back his wife. The spiritual husband is fighting for his wife. He not care what they happen in the physical world. They don't care how you live your physical world. It is none of their business. They think only of their spiritual world. So they said in the spiritual realms that this Jujue Kwensu spiritual husband is already holding the corpse of revengeance that is ready to pour on Yule Doshi because they don't revenge with their wife. They don't revenge with whosoever is close to them. They revenge with the man that is snatching their wife, that is sleeping with their wife. And the worst thing that can ever happen to a, a woman that has spiritual husband is for you sleeping with their wife. That one not good again at all. They can take what you put inside that one to use it to fight against your finance, your life, your health, anything. They can fight against you. So we need to be very prayerful. May God not allow Juju to enter into the life of any of our family. Because this woman knows very well what is happening to you, Ledoshe. My people, according to the information, they let us know that yesterday night it was a battle for you, Ledoshe. They say they fight him, they boss him, they beat him up in the night, my people. Now let God now go deliver you, Ledoshe. In the spiritual realms, they beat him up. But maybe he will be dreaming. In his dream, he will see people uh, chasing him, 
people uh, chasing him in, chasing him in the dream and sometimes maybe he fall and they'll start beating in the dream he will think that that is a dream but that is something that in the spiritual realms that they beat that person up in the spiritual realms when they come to beat you this is what you dream those people that can still remember their dreams you see yourself in a dream people chasing you so that means in the spiritual world they are beating you so they say they don't beat you like those correct beating this is what the spiritual husband of juju queens will always do to you like doshi this man will come go they beat you like doshi and juju queens who is seeing everything though we know she have come to destroy to buy but she will sit down there looking at them treating you like doshi like an object my people like my video subscribe to my youtube channel as you do so may god bless you in jesus name inshallah and for those of you that are subscribed may the light of god shine upon you and your family in jesus name